What's going on guys? I'm sorry I'm all dirty and disgusting, but what we're gonna be doing today is actually gonna be a little messy. So I didn't wanna put like good clean clothes. But uh, anyways, what we have for today's video, we're gonna be doing the first oil change on the Grom. We're not gonna be replacing any seals or anything. I'm actually gonna get into the engine. Uh, they say that the first oil change, you just drain it out, put the new oil in, and then wait until like 15, 1500 miles, and then actually open it and clean the pan that it's in there. You just take it out and clean it out and whatever. We'll worry about that in a later video. So what we're gonna do today again is take the bolt out, drain it, pull, put the bolt back in and put the new oil in. So let me show you what I got. I went to Walmart, I got a funnel. You don't have to. And then what I got is a 10W40 um, four stroke motorcycle oil and uh, I read a bunch of reviews well not reviews but like forums and stuff and they all were saying different oils uh, 10 W30 uh, but I've always used an online motorcycle 10 W40 so that's what I'm gonna use then I have to go get it I don't have it right here I don't have an oil pan so what I'm gonna use is a old shoe box so that's where the oil is gonna go and then I'm gonna take it to my local um, Napa or AutoZone or whatever and then they dispose of it. Also, since this video is going to be too short, what I actually did is um, I went online and I got uh, some stickers for the Grom. I'm going for the, for the black and red scheme. So what I got is actually some red stickers. So we're going to be swapping those. I'm just going to hit it with the heat gun, the ones that are already on the bike take them out and put the new ones in. It's gonna be a really short video and I hope you guys enjoy it and let's get to it. Shoebox. All right, so once we go under the bike, on the side of the exhaust, you're gonna see that sticking out and then you're gonna see a bolt behind it. That's a 17 millimeter bolt that we're gonna be taking out and that's the drain plug, okay? So let's get to it. Let's get some gloves. All right, so you take the bolt out. Obviously you wanna get like a paper towel or something and clean it out before you put it back on. But um, oil is draining out, just let it drain until it can anymore. And then put the bolt back up, put the new oil in, you're done. Like I said, it's gonna be a really short video today, so. Let's go ahead and clean the bolt. Make sure you guys level the bike so everything comes out. Put the bolt back on. Make sure you clean the bolt before you put it on. Put the bolt. Your 17 millimeter. And tighten it up. All right, so what we're gonna do now is we open the oil cap. That's the oil that I got. Open it up. Up. 
Take the funnel out, put the stick back in. And that is it for the oil change. So that is pretty much it for the oil change. So like I said, now we're gonna do the stickers and we're done. I mean, it's literally five minutes, maybe 10, and you're done. Heat gun. Get the heat gun. All right, so we get the gun, and that's, that's it. We just heat it up. And then it just comes right out. Now let's do the same thing on the other side, and we'll put the new stickers, and we're done. Two stickers. Garbage, and we get the new stickers. We take it out. Now with this stickers, you always have to like go over it so it actually sticks to the paper that it has to stick to. Boom. Now we're gonna go over to the bike. Make sure you don't touch the back of the sticker with your hands dirty because then it won't stick so just align it to where you like it and then with your nail just go ahead and go over it that looks sexy let's repeat the same thing on the other side and that's it all right guys so we're done now you can hit it again with the gun so that the glue actually melts a little bit and it glues really good but I'm not gonna do it it's really hot here in Florida so it'll, it will do it itself but let me show you guys how it looks that is one side and that is the other side all right guys so that's all i have for you today um again oil change and the stickers for the grom like i said it was going to be a really short video so i hope you guys enjoyed it i hope this video was useful if you guys are trying to do the first oil change or if you guys were looking into changing your stickers or anything like it or are you or you're trying to make it look more your color scheme that you're going for i'm going for the black and red on this bike so that's why I chose the red, but I will leave the link on the description. But anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Go ahead and hit that thumbs up, comment, subscribe, whatever you guys want. If you guys have any ideas or of any videos that you guys want me to make, leave it down in the comment and I will make it. Now, don't ask me to eat Tide Pops because I won't eat it. Anyway, guys, have a good day and I'll see you on the next one.